She's a maker and a printmaker. And um, these are pieces that work with layering and concealing context and uh, motifs. And they work with opacity and having uh, one side that's permanently concealed when you mount it is something to expand the experience of the person who knows the context versus the person who doesn't and have that kind of dynamic.
pandemic. Um, and this one was the first one started because I couldn't get to my big studio, so I was working with small pieces, and it's called Monsters Among Us. And it's all about what was internal and external that caused this. So that's what these pieces are about. And they're a mixture of um, silk screen, paint, and crayon. I do a lot of so great. And then these are pieces that as I is coming out a little bit. I don't have to get the light one. And the same thing with the drawings. These drawings are all cast off over paper. And then and these are um crayon on the paper. And uh, they're they're just they're abstract.
accept this one the explanation the explanation of that's why we are here yeah and this is a tribute of Armando Reveron he's the master they call it the master of the light mm -hmm. and was an amazing artist during the period of the uh, beginning of the last century okay um, this is the son of Venezuelan artists making a tribute of this Venezuelan artist. Okay. And right here, we have two or original pieces of him. Yeah. And uh, four Latin American people, mm -hmm. the uh, four Latin American people, he was one of those making an exhibition at the MoMA after that. exhibition, this tribute to, to his life and his technique. Also, Armando Reveron, as a curious uh, note, he is one of the four or five Latin American artists that had an exhibition at the MoMA. So he's our national heritage. Yeah. 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 Yeah.